Family sharing allows up to six devices in your family to share Apple services like Apple Music, app purchases, photos, family calendar, current locations, and more. All of this even though each person has their own Apple ID and password. An adult in the family may activate family sharing by tapping on Settings. On the Settings screen, tap on your name. You might now be prompted to sign in. Tap on Family Sharing. There are many benefits to family sharing. An adult needs to be the family organizer. Seeing as you are setting up family sharing, you will be the organizer. Let's tap on Continue. If you have any children that don't already have an Apple ID, then you can create one now. Let's go ahead and invite family members. Select how you would like to invite them. If the family member is in your contacts, then type their name or type their phone number or email. Now, select the person. You may invite more than one family member. Send the invitation by tapping. The invitation was sent. Next, tap Done. Manage family sharing by tapping. Notice you are now listed as the organizer. The family member you added is now listed and indicates an invitation has been sent. If you would like to send invitations to more family members, then tap the Add button. Family Checklist offers suggestions for more family sharing features. When finished, tap Done. Listed are features family members can share. Let's tap on Subscriptions. Many Apple subscriptions can be shared by the family. Here you can see what your current shared subscriptions are, as well as manage these subscriptions. Listed may be a variety of more available subscriptions. For example, let's tap on Apple Subscriptions. Here you see a variety of subscription options that may be tapped on for further information. I'll tap to return. When finished, swipe back. Let's tap on Purchase Sharing. As Family Organizer, you will be billed for any subscription or media purchases made by the family sharing members. Don't worry, as the Family Organizer, you can set up Ask to Buy, where you are notified and must approve purchases before they are made by family members under the age of 18. This age varies by location. For more information, please view our Ask to Buy tutorial. You may set this up later in Settings or tap to continue. If you don't have a payment method attached to your Apple ID, you may be prompted to provide a credit card, debit card, or PayPal account and be responsible for all purchases made by the family. Family sharing is great because some purchases may be shared by everyone in your family sharing group. So, for example, if you or a family member purchases an app, the rest of the family can share and download the app on their devices. An individual family member may later go into settings and turn off purchase sharing for themselves. You may set this up later or tap to turn on. You may be prompted to invite family members to share their purchases. I'll tap Not Now. Next, let's tap on Location Sharing. You can share your location with the family members. When this is enabled, you and your family can use the Find My app to locate each other as well as locate a lost or stolen device. For more information, please view our Find My tutorials. When finished, swipe back. Only the family organizer may access member options, like removing a member from family sharing, enabling parent guardian, and managing ask to buy. Let's go back to settings by holding down the back button and then slide your finger down to select settings. When finished, return to the home screen. It's great to be able to share among family members. Visit us at MyMobileGenius.com for tutorials and more. Empowering Mobility